Ooh, I like it. Oh, everybody's staring at me. <laughs> Okay, so today I am at Goodwill in Troy, New York. This Goodwill is a hit or miss, so let's get inside and see what we can find to resell on eBay. All right, I got my lucky cart. Um, let's start over here. I just want to look at the ceramic set. Oh, it has crazing on it. Now I'm curious what that says. A oh, coral. <laughs> And then this soup tureen, made in Japan, signature Japan. Anything over here? What about that vase? Hmm, it's interesting. It does have some age to it for $7.99. It has like the raised flowers. I'm not sure about that. All right, so a little busy, but most people are looking at the clothing. There's a big pile of shoes. <laughs> All right, let's see if there's anything over here. What is that? Ooh, it lights up for $12.99. Then we have these cabbage leaves. Upper Canada Soup Candle Maker. Hmm. Alright, anything down here? Ah, oh, that cute tea set. Ah, oh, the Silvestri. That's not a bad brand on some of the items. We have this bird plate. Whoops. Eastern Bluebird. Hmm. How much is that? $2.99. Ooh. Let's see if this is the stone critters. Oh, it's not. <gasps> Look how cute that is. Castagna. Made in it designed design in Italy but made in China. <laughs> 6 dollars I wish it was the stone critters. Look how cute these are, the welcome. Of course I have to look at this cookie jar. Uh, oh, they didn't tape the lid on. Let me take the top off. Oh, it's Pioneer Woman. Hmm. Some chipping and a crack there. Put that back. Let's see what these are. At first I thought they were coffee grinders. Made in China for $2.99. Kind of neat. It has bamboo. I'm also thinking about, I have to think about items to pick up for our booth case. So I was thinking maybe those, but nah. I still want the quality items in there. Some twine um, apples. Yeah, they're falling apart. <laughs> this dish looks familiar to me. Oh, it's Parique. Yale for $2.99 each. What is the color? The color is red today. Let me go over here. For some reason I like the end caps. <laughs> it's kind of bare. We have the flower globe. That's a little bit newer. I always like those. These are different kind of mugs. It's glass, it's, is it glass? No, they're not. What about these canisters? Okay. Not seeing anything. Ooh, what about this vase? Turn that over, it's newer. It's made to look like it's old. This is all transferred on and they make it look like there's crazing. Nice. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, look at that. It's an ornament, it's Holy Bible. Little well, um, air freshener that you plug in. 
There's a name for it, I forgot. <laughs> a wooden fish. I don't think it's monkey pod. These are kind of neat. New me for $5.99. WW dot. Huh. Put that back there. There's um a witch's broom. <laughs> Alright, these. I think this is something you put in the microwave, if I can remember. $6.99, the lit and wear. This is a larger one, but I feel like even the large one sells for like $20, $25. That's $6.99. It's kind of cool, salt rocks. Remember to always check on the bottom. And that's what we find on the bottom. <laughs> Bunch of shower heads. Oh, that's a Dyson. Hmm. I could resell that as a replacement. How about this one? $7.99 for Dyson. I know Dyson is an expensive brand to pick up. Let's check to see if this is Dorothy Thorpe. Um, I don't think it is. I think they call it Queenswear, if I can remember. Dorothy Thorpe. And she uses um sterling silver on hers. I'm liking this vase back here. Oh, I can't get it out. I like the flowers on it too. The Japanese flowers. Home trends. And let's see if this is sterling silver. No, it's not. Um Wallace Silver Plate $4.99. These pewter. I think it's pewter. It has some age to it. How much are those? $5.99. This one. It's $5.99. I want to peel that sticker. Alright, it says hands climbed. Denhag Holland. They're six dollars each. I like the handle on it. I might put it up. Oh, the lid is broken. Totally comes off. Okay, I'm just gonna leave them. I was gonna get it. I really like the handle on it. The checkered design. Oh well. Look at this picture back here. Look at the handle. It has dragonflies on it. I wonder who made that. It kind of has like an Art Nouveau type of look to it. It's $12.99. So before I spend that, I would have to see how much I could get for it. I'm thinking over $20. i will do a Google Lens search on that, but let's look down here first. Oh, what are those? Oh, a sticker's still on it. Anchor Hawking Honey Gold. Ooh, uh, never seen the actual sticker before. That's kind of cool. Not for ten dollars. It's a willow. <laughs> willow tree, four ninety nine. I remember when these were big. Every um gift shop had them. People went nuts over it. I'm trying to read that. I see www dot. <laughs> that looks like it could be. McCoy? No. Just says BP1 1499. Just feel like it has some quality to it. That's Pottery Barn for $4.99. Alright, my cart is empty. I gotta find something. Let me see what is over here. I'm not really seeing anything. Hmm. Mexico box. Let me take a look at that. That would have been good for Valentine's Day. Block made in Spain. $30 for the set. I do like that red. Let me see what is over here. Oh, what about this wooden figurine? Oh, it's a nurse. She looks like she just gave an enema. <laughs> $2.99. Um, I wonder if 
Why is her foot like that? Did you know? Oh, some paint missing. I gotta leave it. And something is broken on her hand. Butterfly. I think that's the looking. I forget what that's called. You look through it and you see the colors. <laughs> oh, a cute um, bee and butterfly mug for a dollar. It's not too bad. Ooh, these are funny. Where is Michael when I need him? <laughs> to try this on for $2.99. That'd be funny if we both tried it on. What about the crystal? Here's a um, crystal vase. Some chipping on there for $3.99. It's a nice shade made in China. $5.99. Oh, look at that. Oh, it feels like a restaurant wear mug set. <laughs> what does it say on the back? Bad Dog Original Brand. I think I'll get that for $2. I don't see any damage. And people like dogs. So if that's cheap enough, I will put it right in the cart. Oh, this is, um... Let me see if I can remember before I turn it around. Mikasa? Yes. I sold a set of four of these for, I think it was like 40 or $60. So I'm gonna get one for a dollar. I don't see any damage. Awesome. Is there any more? I don't see any, cause I would get them. We have the seagull cup. All right, let's see if there is anything in the fabrics. I usually find something over here. <laughs> it's a crocheted. Oh, that's kind of neat. Look at the ruffles. That's like a 3D, it's a baby blanket. What does that say? It's Selen, Selena. Hm. Let me see what this lace is. It's a tablecloth. I thought it was a table runner at first. It's a Christmas one with um, Santa on the sleigh, then the village. I kind of like that. I wish it was closer to Christmas. That's pretty. It's a curtain for $7.99. Let me see what these are. Ooh, I like it. It's, it has like a boho type style. It feels like there's quality to it. Let me see who made it. Uh, Nate wall decor. Oh, it's $15.99. I don't think I could do that. Do I want it for myself? <laughs> nah. My bedroom is mainly antique. So I don't think this would match. I forgot to take a look at this porcelain. Virginia. It says Delphs. Oh, and it's marked on the bottom. How much is that? Uh, four ninety nine. I wonder, Virginia. Hmm. I mean, it feels kind of cheap for some reason. I don't know why. I'm gonna leave that. Here's a tea set in this bag. Um, this is made in China, and then there's Frenzy Toys. Made in China. So I wonder. I'm wondering about that Frenzy toy. That's $10. I'm going to look Frenzy toy up. There is a market for the Frenzy toys um, tea set. It doesn't have too much um, good resale value. So I'm going to leave that. Oh, look at this frog. Picture frame. National Aquarium in Baltimore. What's popping out? I kind of like that for $3.99. Oh, it's missing something. I wonder what it, what went in there. Hmm. Look at this divided dish. It looks like it could be um, made in Italy. Handmade in Italy for $5.99. I do like that. 
a little divided dish. Let's see what's on there. Carrot, tomato, eggplant. Hmm. For $5.99. I might put that in. Okay. There, it's starting to fill up a little bit. What about these red birds? It's flashed on. Yeah, it's all, the red is coming off on that. You have this mug with a lid. That's St. Nicholas Square. Oh, here's one of those weird mugs. I think that's a no drip mug for a dollar. Oh, look at the Santa. <laughs> It's a lazy Santa on vacation. I want to make sure that doesn't fall out before I turn it over. That's yeah, Yankee Candle for $10. It's a little bit too much. I wonder what went there. We have this awesome fruit bowl. Or just a decorated bowl. Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, it has star eyes. It's a homemade... um. I wonder what you put there. Washcloths? I don't know. Alright, let me see what is in the cases, because I'm not seeing anything else back there. Ooh, a cart full of electronics. It's Motorola. $7.99. Some Sony headphones. Let's see if there's an iPad in there. No, but it's a keyboard. That's kind of neat. All right, I was selfie stick. That's an older one. Look at the gnomes. Oh, I like that. How much is that? Turnover, a dollar ninety nine. I think I'll get that. I don't see any stains or rips or any kind of use. Looks like there's a bunch of shoes and gloves. Those are vintage gloves. I always, I'm starting to look more at perfumes and um, lotions, because some of them do sell. Our um, reseller friend, Stephanie, found some that sold for crazy money. Let me go over here. I wanted to look at these elephants, but they're definitely newer. Probably from Burlington Co. Factory or Marshalls. I'm, I'm actually not sure where, but they look kind of neat. They're $7.99 each. Those are funky glasses. I like the stars on it. Elton John. <laughs> I'm digging these cat glasses. I may have to try them on. Ooh, I like it. Everybody's staring at me. <laughs> Let me see if there's anything in the toy section. I always overlook the toy section. Oh, look how cute. There's um, Winnie the Pooh. Which they want for that $6.99. Um, it's a monitor. Yeah, it's a monitor for... Ten dollars. Look at all the cute little shoes. <laughs> all right, not seeing anything in the toys. All right, let me go down here. Look at the clothing. Okay. Ooh, a fresh cart. More shoes. And what about these glasses? I think that's from a restaurant. It's flashed on. What about this mug? Oh, it's a ghost. Okay. If it was a vintage ghost. I see some makeup. See, I don't know makeup. I don't know if that's worth picking up for $2 and $2. Hmm. 
Hello Kitty. It's a ceramic light, oh, a ceramic soap holder and toothbrush holder for $1.99. Hmm. I thought it was more vintage. I think people are starting to get the mint green, all those um, weird color um, porcelain or ceramic. Let me see what these dishes are. That is from um, JCPenney. That looks like it could be enamel. Handmade in Japan for $7.99. It is enamel. Okay, put that back. All right, I think I am going to check out. Um, not too much luck, but I'm getting the Mikasa glass, the restaurant wear, this towel thingy. <laughs> and the Made in Italy uh, divided dish. Okay, so my total spend was only 32 cents. That's because I had some points I had to use. So I, I think I got five, I think I got six or seven dollars off, which is awesome. But I think my favorite find is this mug. I love the dog on it and it's M, I don't think I showed everybody, it's Mware China. Um, so I should be able to get a lot more than $2 for this. Now I'm going to head over to our local Goodwill. I'm going to try to get two videos out. And this Wednesday we'll be doing a live sale with Avon Thrifty Rich and Kate Follow That Bug. This Wednesday at 8 o'clock. So I hope I see everybody there. All right, and I'll see everybody next time. Bye!